All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Classroom of the Elite season three, episode thirteen, the finale of the season. Um, yes, it's finally here. Um, God, the season flown by. Not gonna lie. Um, yeah, last episode was pretty damn good. It was very appealing or like wholesome, I would say. Satisfying, one would say. Um, yeah, the uh, firstly we one of the things that I, I don't know kind of got skipped over but i guess it's not really a big deal because everybody's a little bit more focused now is that we got moved back down to class 1d um but like as they said they're gonna they're gonna move up again soon hopefully um the main focus of the episode was the third year's graduation or well everybody was kind of moving up because it was the end of year thing but third year's graduating mostly hottie heat's brother obviously being one of them um we see kind of uh, nice scenes between them finally being bro brother sisterly and uh, Horikisa kind of maybe changing for the better. Um, if not just physically, she got a haircut. Um, so I guess we'll see. Um, she's going to be less acting less like her brother now, less stoic and less uh, serious, I suppose. But more still gung-ho and still uh, trying her best to kind of get us get a class to class A um, as well as the uh, Ayakoji and Anisu made like a I want to say allyship I don't know um, between the teachers and them um, because they're going to be trying to get rid of the current principal or current chairman so that's going to be interesting too uh, but yeah very excited for this episode, so as always guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Who is this girl? Change Ryunkun? Is this someone from his class? Why do I vaguely know this girl? Do we know this girl? Am I supposed to? Is this another girl in the harem that I forgot about? So she's from Ryun's class. Oh, look at her wearing a necklace. Cute. I don't mind. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> what about it? <laughs> yeah, I feel like, did they meet in the library at one point? I Because she mentioned library as well. I'm like vaguely remembering this. Oh, <laughs> she's so jealous. You forgot? Did you just want to piss her off? <laughs> You're such a bitch. Was that a tactic? Be mean, keep him keen? Like, what the hell is going on? Oh, okay. Double agent? Uh huh? Oh, is he going to be in, be in with every class? Wait, who the hell is this? Oh, yeah, this guy's in class B, isn't he? Okay. A <laughs> bootlicker. Damn! Supporter. No, he said bootlicker. Okay, them's fine, Wes. Let's go. Why would he want to... Oh, well, you guys are class 1C again, are you? Yeah. Damn. Oh, yeah, Ichinose, the... There's, there's a porch right there, standing under there. What's wrong with you? Are we, are we seeing everybody in this episode? Just a little send-off? Um, what is happening right now? Yeah. Hand on face. Okay, boy. I like that. It's given her like a, a point to focus on. So she doesn't lose her way. <laughs> Look how easy he manipulates people. Oh my god. Jesus, man. So if you fuck up this year, I'm gonna we'll meet here again and I'll say something that absolutely ruins you. 
Uh, I could have... Hang on, what does that say? I could have easily and safely won five matches in the special exam for the rest. Please talk to Ayana koji -kun. <laughs> There was something, but he doesn't have to admit to that. Yeah? Oh, beat his ass. Damn! Look at him breaking a sweat. <laughs> Damn. What did he do? <laughs> Pause. <laughs> Who's this? I have no idea who this is. I assume she's from our class, maybe. Just one of Kay's friends, I guess. Is this like the the dating simulator episode, like that, where all the heroines fall for <laughs> the main dude collectively? Um. Sure. Yeah. Oh wow, we really are meeting up with everyone. Yeah, he's prepared for that. Oh shit. Oh god, another Ryan Koji. <laughs> I believe that, 100%. Uh, what the fuck? In this dark alley. Uh-huh. Oh, that's her, okay. I don't know what the hell you're talking about. Never mind, he admitted it. Bro, he's the puppet master. Relax. Oh, he's calling Kai. Okay. <laughs> master and pawn. Whoa, okay. Y'all ain't ready. <laughs> True. Yeah. Oh, interesting. I'll tell you when you lose. And you will. Hmm. Interesting. A little Horikita Ainokoji battle. Looking forward to it. Damn, that episode went quick. Never mind, we got a big block at the end, after the uh, outro. Let's have a look. Why do I feel like I know what's going to happen here? Oh, see, it doesn't necessarily need to be Ainokoji, or is she just saying this? <laughs> she is jealous. Aww. Is he actually? Huh? Oh my god, he is. <laughs> is it? Wow. I f yeah, that's. I, f I thought he was going to do this. What the hell? Is it just kind of like a... To keep her close kind of thing? Yeah, <laughs> I fucking knew he did that. What, and give your attention to someone else? Sure. Oh, girl. You poor manipulated child. <laughs> Feels like he's reading from an invisible book. Yo. This is the weirdest hug ever. It literally feels like he just read all this in a textbook, like how to ask someone on a date, or how, how to ask someone out. Also getting that um, that one scene in Death Note of Light and his girlfriend, where he's like evil facing when they hug. 
Learn about romance. Okay. The textbook known as K. Oh. It! Oh my god! Oh wait, is he saying it about romance or about K? I, I choose to believe K. It's way funnier. Right, so that was the finale episode of Classroom of the Elite Season 3. Um, <laughs> a lot to say about that episode. It felt like we were going around the characters a lot, like, uh, giving them all, giving all the kind of, maybe, like, some important ones, some just haven't had much screen time kind of characters. Um, like, a, a little bit at the end there. But yeah, there was a lot going on there. Um, Ayana Koji moving up his kind of use of his full power here. Um, and obviously with his battle against Horikita, she wants him to use his full power which is not necessary. Um, but there is obviously someone coming in from the White Room um, who's going to try and take Ainokoji down. Uh, so maybe this is the person, maybe he, obviously Ainokoji being the, the best product that the White Room produced, maybe he is going to be underestimating this person. Maybe that will make him use his ability more. Um, but we'll see. This whole this whole thing with Kay is so fucked up. The the way he be manipulating this girl, but honestly, you know, it's it's not real. So <laughs> I, I I fuck with it. Not gonna lie, <laughs> it makes for good drama. And uh, yeah, I really love Aina Koji and his little manipulating tactics. But uh, yeah, uh, very excited uh, for the obviously fourth season. Uh, I don't know if one's been conf confirmed yet, but I assume. If I check Twitter after this, there's probably going to be something about it, as it usually goes. Um, but yeah, anyway guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reactions today. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.